first we have to gut it. You have to what? I've get... never carved no or painted pumpkins, a pumpkin no ever. Pumpkins, and we have to cut off the top. So when you want to kill a pumpkin, <laughs> you first stab it in soup. <laughs> What's your pumpkin? Um, Jeffrey. This is Isabel the pumpkin. Isabel the pumpkin. Yep. <laughs> Moment of truth. <laughs> Do you want the black one or the orange one? <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> you want me to stick my hand in there? Uh, this ooh. guy. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> you ever really wanted to know what it felt like to stick your hand in someone's brain? I didn't think he was gonna say brain. <laughs> <laughs> this is an intense process. It was like a workout. Maybe it's our next, next bit of fit sick. Carve a pumpkin. As you're doing a wall sit. I think that's pretty good. Right? <laughs> First time. Ooh. Maybe that's an eyeball? A scar. <laughs> or a scar. He's gonna have butt teeth. <laughs> nice. Is that a squeak? Yep, I squeak a lot. I already forgot my pumpkin's name. Isabella. Jeffrey. That's mine. What's up, Jason? That was Jeffrey's voice. <laughs> Jeffrey doesn't like to talk about it. No. <laughs> oh, look at his little eyebrows. They're on fleek. They're all fleek? That's what the kids say. No, for real though, my shoulder is getting a workout right now. Squeaker! My pumpkin's thick, that's why. You should be one of the thick ones. Oh, I'm sorry, Fitbit. I anticipated this being a lot harder. There are the eyebrows and the eyes, folks. Evil! <laughs> I'm gonna skip the, the nose entirely and go straight for the mouth. Because who needs to smell? All right, ladies and gentlemen, my eyes. Those eyes are awesome. Thanks. Little eyeball thingies. Yeah. I did mine on the side and the inside. I can't really tell as much. I did mine like last minute. I was like, this guy should probably have eyeballs, not just sockets. Eyeballs. Isabella is better than that. <laughs> ah, it's getting darker. We'll finish these pumpkins before it rains. He looks happy. Right? I know. I'm going to just do that side nose, like the nose going off one direction. One direction. <laughs> Folks. Jason wore a pumpkin, this is why I look like. So when you carve these pumpkins, don't go onto some random person's property because that's kind of what we're doing right now. Yeah. Hopefully we don't, we don't get arrested. Oh, that's neat. Oh. There he is. There. Ah, Isabella. Look, so happy. She's so happy. She looks like she's <laughs> happy about to like eat your face. His pumpkin's like, hey, baby. Hey. Yeah. Hey, baby, I like your buck tea. Do you know any Halloween songs? I'm gonna come and eat your brains. I think mine's done. It looks like a cat. I can now understand why people get so excited to do these and they take tons of time to make them very intricate. Because now that I've done it once, I want to like perfect mine and then make it look exactly like me. <laughs> right? First carving experience. And I'm a mess. And I'm disgusting. This was actually a lot of fun. Yeah, he was going into those pumpkins. What? What? We don't do that in Philly. I just want to paint it a little bit, not a lot. This kit provided us with paint, but paint is optional. I already messed up its eyebrows. I mess up my eyebrows every night, so this makes sense. These are bushy Italian eyebrows. <laughs> I think you need some facial hair. Meow. I think I'm just going to draw whiskers on it because it looks like a cat to me. Do cats have eyebrows? <laughs> they do now. <laughs> I don't know what my pumpkin is. It's like a mutant cat. All right, so this is what we were looking at right now. De describe your pumpkin. Okay, so what we got here is Mr. Jeffrey with some eyebrows, some good triangle eyes, a big triangle nose, and a nice little smile right there. Has some ears on the side, and of course, since I have <laughs> facial hair, I had to put a little mustache and a goatee. Of course, his mustache looks nothing like a mustache, but that's okay. He's a little salt and pepper, right? That's right, little gray, little black. That's how it. That's how it goes. How How would you rate your overall pumpkin carving experience? I would have to rate my pumpkin carving experience as an eight point five. Only well, thing that could have made it better is if I actually carved Jeffrey a little bit better. I think he looks pretty happy. He looks like a, a happy Jeffrey pumpkin. Hey, Jeff. All right, cool. Mine's like a mutant cat. I would I would want to say. So let's see. I. I gave it some buck teeth. I don't right. think cats have buck teeth, but <sighs> this one does. Right. Um, it, the, the nose is kind of going downward like a cat. As right. you can see, it's got the whiskers. Um, I gave it some eyeballs, some black eyebrows. Mm. And since I'm obsessed with my eyebrows, I decided to give it some Italian eyebrows. There you go. Nice. So right in there. And yeah, she's a happy little Isabella pumpkin. Isabella is, is her name. And Isabella cat pumpkin. Put her hat on and she's like, 
good to go. So Jeffrey and Isabella are about to rock out. Yeah, let's say, yeah. yeah. Folks, that is how you carve a pumpkin.